So brand new regulator installed, new copper line, looking good. So Don, would you explain to me what all the outlets on top of the tanker are for? Yes, this is a, a liquid withdrawal. Okay. Here's your gauge, uh -huh. percentage gauge. As, as long as it's in This is, I call it a three on the tree. It's your shut off valve. Okay, shut so, off the I'm supply to the house. Uh huh. This is where they put the propane in. Ah, okay, cool. Very cool. This is a vapor return valve. Ah. That's pretty much it. And this one right here, our ah. driver uses it to uh, let him know when it's absolutely at 86.5%. Ah. Oh, so it's 86.5. I thought you could only go up to 80. 85, 86. Good to know. As soon as the liquid starts coming out of here, that's full. Mm -hmm. So we've got those little, like the little barbecue tanks as well, right? They got those little bleeders? Yes. Right, okay, cool. The liquid pro propane boils at 44 degrees below zero. Wow. So when you put it in a capsule, it boils off until it reaches about 150 pounds of pressure and it brings the temperature of the liquid up to 60 degrees above Fahrenheit. Cool. So that's what pushes in your house is the vapor. Ah. That's what burns. So the liquid just boils off. You use some pressure off of the tank. It boils off a little bit more until it reaches a pound of pressure equals about 12 inches of water column. Okay. We're going to see what you got. Oh, I see. There's a little port to test it. Yeah. This test is the high pressure. This tests the low pressure. Good. So your lockup pressure is 12 and a half inches of water column. Perfect. And uh, I'm testing the flow. It's flowing now, so your flow pressure Is 11 and a half which is perfect great it's a preset regulator so mm -hmm. it should be perfect i think yeah